Welcome, in front of me is Oppo Reno 14 FS 5G and in this video I will show you how to fix the problem when your Bluetooth device isn't connecting to your smartphone. First of all, toggle the Bluetooth on and off in your control center which you can slide down right from the top of the screen. Turn on your Bluetooth, then turn it off again, then try to re uh, pair the device to your phone. To do that, uh, put your device into pairing mode, then open Bluetooth settings, and wait until the device appears on the list. Try to connect to it if you uh, aren't already connected to. Then just select this device, select unpair, then wait until it reappears on the screen and then uh, let's connect with it again once you see it maybe we'll, we'll have to restart Bluetooth settings by the way I'm gonna show you how to open Bluetooth settings from, from settings menu so just go to settings then Bluetooth then let's pair with our Bluetooth device once again and see if this solves the problem uh, now, if it doesn't solve your problem, uh, then you can restart your Bluetooth device and your phone. To restart your phone, press the power button and the volume up key at the same time, select restart and wait until your device is restarted. Check if your connection issues are resolved now by going back to Bluetooth and seeing if you are not now connected with your Bluetooth device. But if it, uh, it didn't solve your problem, then go down to System and Update section, select Backup and Reset, then go to Reset Phone option, and then select Reset Network and Bluetooth settings. Confirm, when, wait until the settings are reset, and after that, try reconnecting your Bluetooth device with your phone once again. So go to Bluetooth settings, enable your Bluetooth, select the device that you want to pair with, uh, then click pair and see if this resolved your problem. And I hope at this point the problem is resolved, but to uh, improve the situ situation even more, uh, go to system and updates, check for software updates, uh, make sure that you are connected to the internet beforehand. Uh, let me actually reconnect to the internet. Now, check if your phone has any updates, and if it does, then, of course, uh, take your time, uh, download and install all the updates uh, that you have. And after that, you'll hopefully no longer encounter this problem. And uh, at this point, I'm gonna finish this video, so thank you so much for watching it. If you liked it, please consider subscribing to our channel, leave us a like in the comment below, and I'll see you in the next one.